are some of the side effects of radiation therapy? Uh, it can create nausea. It can create tiredness. It can uh, also, if you're radiating a bone, it can stop the marrow that used to produce red blood cells. It stops its ability. So it no longer functions for you anymore. It'll change your blood counts. It will do things to your body that you would see as a negative, but the overall positive from stopping the cancer at that point is better than not. Um, there are lots of other things. You can radiate other parts of the body as far as the organ. You can radiate part of the heart. You can radiate a lung or a kidney trying to take care of your cancer. So radiation doesn't just hit the spot it needs to. It hits a lot of spots. And there are side effects with it. As far as chemotherapy, lots and lots of side effects. Some people have more, some have less. I've been lucky, it wasn't that bad. Some people have a change in taste of food. Some people have a uh, tiredness. Some people have aches and joints you never knew you had. Um, the chemotherapy will make you, uh, with steroids and all, retain fluids, do things that your body has never done before. Your fingernails don't grow, you lose your hair. You do all kinds of other things, as well as with radiation, you can lose your hair. And then with hormone therapy, the same things still evolve out of it. So there's not one single treatment out there that doesn't have a side effect. Hormone therapy, hot flashes, and especially for a man, you're gonna have them. And the women, now I know what you're talking about and I feel for you more. <laughs> I totally understand and now I know what it feels because when it starts on my body, I just am about saying it's terrible but you get past it. Uh, so they all, in my opinion, all three have side effects. The more you read from other people in the forums and grab the info from others that have gone through what we're going through, share the info and you will feel better and you won't be as afraid. And one thing I'll tell you also, keep a journal. And then every time you're treated with something, keep a journal and then you, you have more information, you're educated and you understand that's just my medicine, it's okay. But if you have a doubt, talk to your doctor.